Hi there, students. I have a question from Bill Appill asking what's the difference between maintain and remain? Okay, the first thing I think that's important with these two verbs is to maintain is a transitive verb. Somebody or something maintains something else. It's transitive. It needs a direct object. Whereas to remain is intransitive. So somebody maintains something, but something remains. So to remain, to stay in the same place, to stay in the same condition, not to change. So, um, I remained at home while my wife went out to work. Um, I was told to uh, remain there while uh, the shop assistant went to get the thing I, I had asked for. Yeah. Um, the uh, rate of interest... Uh, today remains the same as last week. It hasn't changed. The price remains the same. So it continues as it is. Okay, to maintain is to continue to keep in existence, not to allow to become less. So, for example, you need to maintain your standards. Yeah, you need to uh, maintain order in the classroom as a teacher. Yeah, but maybe you ask the students to remain silent. Yeah, uh, or maybe you could ask them to <laughs> maintain silence. OK, so um, to maintain, to continue to have. We can also use to maintain, to keep something in good condition. So, um, the, uh, the town hall maintains these roads very badly. Yeah, this house is very badly maintained, looked after, kept in, con in the right condition. And then also as well to maintain is to continue to say that you believe something. So I, whatever you say, I still maintain that this is true. Um, the criminal, although he'd been found guilty by the judge, maintained that he was innocent. Yeah. So to maintain, to, to hold up or to keep... Uh, your position or the words that you've said and to support them. To remain. Okay, so the first thing, to stay in the same condition. We also use to remain, meaning to continue to exist. Yeah, um, so only um, a few stones remained of the ancient building. Okay, so to continue to exist, other after other parts have just fallen down, they've fallen away. Yeah, um, after the meal, nothing remained. There was nothing left. There was nothing left over. Um, okay, so uh, how many people remained after the lesson? Just a few students. OK, so to stay in the same place or in the same condition or to continue it to exist after other parts have gone. Yeah, we could have an adjective remaining. So split uh, this this into two and use half of it now and use the remaining half later. OK, um, to maintain. OK, so to maintain, you could maintain a person by giving, the, giving them the things that it's necessary to live. Maintenance. So you're keeping them up to a level. Yeah, to maintain, to keep in existence, to not allow to become less. So uh, we have maintained our friendship through over many years. In this case, our friendship has remained has remained strong for many years. 
Okay, so, to remain, to continue in the same place, to stay behind, to stay in the same position. Yeah, um, so the answer to this question remains in doubt. Yeah, it's not clear. Um, different people maintain, support different uh, positions. So the maintain has an idea of supporting something, keeping it le keeping it as it was. Um, yes, uh, very few of this type of animal remain. Yeah, uh, because of habitat loss, and we need to maintain to support to keep up what is left of their habit. Yeah, um, to remain something that still needs to be dealt with. So we've done the we've done the first two jobs, but the last one still remains. It still continues to exist, to endure, to persist. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, the memories of your memories of the past remain, but you can't maintain them. OK, so to maintain, to support somebody, to assist uh, it, to keep going, to keep up, to preserve, to uphold. Yeah. Or to declare, to assert something is true and to keep uh, saying that it's true. And then to remain something that is left, to stay after other parts have gone away, have been broken or taken or eaten or sold, yeah? Um, or to, to remain, to continue unchanged in a place or an unchanged form. So I tried to dissolve the sugar in the water and I was stirring it for ages, but still some sugar remained at the bottom. OK, to uh, remain, to be left to. So um, this still remains to be done. Yeah. Um, OK, the, the, there is still uh, a little bit of light remaining uh, from the sun. We ought to do go quickly in the time that remains. That is left to us. OK, so as to formality, both of these are neutral words. They're both neutral fives and you can use either of them anywhere. Um, the word remain comes from Latin, remaneo, from the verb maneo, uh, which means to stay or to remain. Whereas to maintain, well, this comes through French, uh, montaner, uh, from Latin, uh, manu tenere, manu, the hand, and tenere, to have, so to hold, to hold with your hand, to maintain, to keep up, yeah? Okay, so if you maintain something, you ensure that it remains by looking after it, and I think that's the, uh, the difference between these two words. So, enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. To maintain and to remain.